A judge has now set a hearing over allegations of misconduct involving the Fulton County, Georgia DA overseeing the election interference case against former President Trump. A lot to this story, so I do want to bring in Steve Harrigan with Fox News joining us live now with the latest details. Steve, good morning. As I mentioned, a lot to this. Certainly, Josh, and keep in mind right now, it's all allegations. No evidence has been presented yet, but that could change in the coming weeks. Right now, the district attorney, Bonnie Willis, who is in charge of prosecuting former President Trump for election interference in Georgia, she is accused by one of the defense attorneys of, one, hiring her married lover, two, paying him more than $650,000 as a prosecutor, and three, that the two of them used some of that money to fund their vacations. Now, the judge has set a hearing for February 15th to look at these allegations. That hearing might be televised, and it could lead to a range of possible outcomes, including throwing out the case against Trump and 14 others entirely. Been filed, if these allegations are true, could lead to a whole host of things that the DA doesn't want to happen. She could be removed from the case. She could be held to have a conflict of interest. The case could potentially be dismissed if it's so structurally unsound that it amounts to a violation of due process. That would be, of course, it gets even more complicated. The prosecutor in question, Nathan Wade, is in the middle of a bitter divorce fight, and his wife has subpoenaed DA, Bonnie Willis. So far, Willis has not confirmed or denied that she is in a romantic relationship with her prosecutor. Josh, back to you. A lot to this story for sure, and a lot uh, left to figure out and develop here. Steve Harrigan there with Fox News. Thank you so much for taking the time to be Thank here you. with us.